Welcome to my CAD tutorials and from this channel you can learn AutoCAD 2D, SketchUp and Lumin from beginner level to advanced level. So in this video I will tell you about how to set unit in AutoCAD. So why we should set unit in AutoCAD. So for example I want to draw one drawing and its all dimensions are in mm unit but the default unit setting in AutoCAD is inches as you can see. So if I am drawing the whole drawing without setting unit in AutoCAD, at last all dimension of that drawing will be completely wrong. So before starting any drawing, it is very important to set a unit of the drawing in AutoCAD. Without setting unit, we cannot draw any drawing precisely as per dimension. So now we will see how to set unit in AutoCAD. So, there are two methods to set unit in AutoCAD. The first method is here you can see the application menu, the logo of the AutoCAD. It is the application menu. Click on the application menu. So you can see here some options. Click on the drawing utilities option and then click on the units. You can see here the one dialog box is open. And the second method to set unit is I am closing this dialog box. Now the second method is type UNIT unit and press the enter. You can see the same dialog box is open here. Now what should we do to set unit? AutoCAD provides us a facility to set unit for length separately and angle separately. So we can set a unit of the length and also set unit of the angle. So what should we do to set unit? First of all you need to select type from here. Here you can see 5 types of length unit setting. Then you need to select the precision as per the requirement. I am selecting decimal from here. And for example in my drawing one dimension is 1.12 unit. So I will select the precision 0, 0.00 from here. Don't forget to select the precision as per requirement and then at last you need to select your unit setting from here. Don't forget to set unit from here. Otherwise no meaning of selecting type and precision from here. Selecting unit from here is mandatory. Then you need to select the angle unit type from here and same as you need to select precision from here as per drawing requirement and after selecting this both click on the ok your your drawing unit is completely set but if you are beginner and don't know about these types i will tell you about these types of the length unit and angle unit so first of all you here you can see architectural type and engineering type architectural unit type and engineering unit type they both are the same unit type they both are based on feet and inches so if you are selecting architectural or engineering you need to compulsory select from here inches or feet you cannot select the millimeter centimeter meter or other unit so architectural and engineering unit type is same but one difference is there the difference is when you select the architectural type it will show the fractional numbers you can see here the example in precision you can see here 1 feet 0 1 by 2 inch 1 by 4 inch these all are fractional number so architectural unit type will show fractional units whereas engineering unit type will show partial numbers or decimal numbers here you can see the example in precision it is showing us 0 feet and 0, 0.0 inch 0 feet and 0, 0.00 inch so architectural unit type and engineering unit type both are same but architectural unit type will show fictional units and engineering unit type will show decimal units now come to the next unit type which is decimal unit and fractional unit so decimal unit and fractional unit they both are also same they both are unitless so we can say that they both are same but the difference is in decimal unit it will show the decimal numbers you can see here the examples in precision and 
the fractional unit will show fractional unit here you can see the examples in precision we can set meter millimeter centimeter or any suitable unit from here don't forget to select the unit from here and the last length unit type is scientific so scientific unit also unitless but it it will show the value as exponent and it will show you need the same as scientific calculator you can see here the examples in the precision this unit is used for a really very tiny or very big drawing if you want to do a very tiny or very big drawing you can use this scientific length unit type and select the precision as per your requirement and select the unit from here as per your requirement we have seen all these five types of length unit now come to the angle unit type and the first unit is decimal degrees so the decimal degrees units are showing decimal numbers the same as a decimal length unit type you can see here the examples in precision it is showing the decimal numbers by doing work with this unit is easiest if allow in your project so it will show the decimal numbers now come to the second type which is degree minute second degree minute second is based on dividing a degree into minutes and minutes into seconds this unit type majorly used for the civil engineers to plotting a geomatical map you can see here the example in precision it is showing zero degree the second is showing zero degree and zero minute third one is showing zero degree zero minute and zero seconds so set precision as per requirement last type is surveyors unit it is also same as degree minute and second but the difference is this unit also shows proper sun direction you can see here the example here it is showing north direction 0 degree and east direction the second one is showing north direction 0 degree 0 minute east direction and the third one is showing north direction 0 degree 0 minute 0 second east direction so if you are civil engineer and you want to plot a geomatical map in autocad you can set the angle unit type is degree minute second or surveyors unit now come to the third unit angle type which is grades grades are also called gradient this is a mathematical unit mathematically 90 degrees is equal to 100 grades so we can say that total 400 grades are available in one circle so if you want to give 45 degree angle you need to input 50 grades as a unit now you can see here the example in precision it is showing 0 grade 0.0 grade 0.00 grade set precision as per your requirement now the fourth angle unit type is radians radians are also mathematical unit mathematically radian means pi and the value of pi is 0.14 so we can say that in circle 180 degrees pi and 360 degrees 2 into pi after selecting radians from here select precision as per requirement you can also see the example from here so don't forget to set precision as per your drawing requirement so we need to set first of all length unit and then angle unit don't forget to select unit from here and click on the okay now you can start draw your drawing so don't forget to set unit because it is very basic and very important setting before starting any drawing so thank you so much for watching if you got something from this video please don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel and press on the bell icon to get notified for new videos